This is another video solution to an example problem. So in a Pinewood Derby contest, a contestant's vehicle starts at the top of the ramp that's 4 meters long and is placed at a 30 degree angle with the floor. If an entry, that is the car, has a mass of 0 0.140 kilograms, then what's the car's potential energy compared to the floor's height? Alright, so let's just start with a quick way of looking at this. I'll list my givens. So if I look at my givens, I've got the length of the ramp being 4 meters long, and it's at a 30 degree angle with a horizontal line. Now the height the car is meters. So I need a reference point. It tells me to compare it to the energy at the floor. So I'm going to call the floor a height of zero. Therefore, what I'm looking for is this, that vertical height on the right. But that's not given. But I can find it because the length of the ramp is a hypotenuse, and the height that I'm after is the opposite side. So that's going to be the sine function. So to find the height of the opposite side, it ends up being 4 meters sine 30 degrees. And sine 30 is just a half. So 4 meters times a half is 2 meters. So that's h. That's the height on the right-hand side. Now the mass, they give me that to be 0.40 kilograms. And, of course, I always know that gravity is going to be 9.80 meters per second squared on the surface of the Earth. Now to solve this, I'm asked to find the potential energy, car's potential energy. That's the gravitational potential energy. So the gravitational potential energy is mgh. That's our formula for it. And our gravitational potential energy is just 0.40. 140 kilograms times 9.8 meters per second squared times 2 meters. So when I do the math, I get 7.8 joules. So, so compared to the bottom, the car has 7.8 joules when it's ready to start. 